Uh, okay, so it's been quite a while since I've played this. So it might take me a second to get used to what's going on and what I've done last. Um, I think the volume I have is really low. Bump this up to like, yeah, we'll go 100. Okay. Uh, what was I working on last? I don't even remember. So I remember the last time I played, I had my scoundrel. I made this guy specifically for the other um, faction. My sniper has always been my main character. This is, okay, so this is the uh, bounty hunter that I made. But it looks like I didn't really make much progress. I also made a sentinel, unless if I just logged into him. And then it looks like I was messing with my Jedi guardian. Uh, let's see, what else do we have here? Here's my OG sniper that I had. Lowered. Okay. Whoop. Ah, shoot. I need to close this out because otherwise it's going to keep going over to my second, my other monitor, my streaming PC. All right. So let's go ahead and jump into this one here then. Um, and I guess we'll go from there. Work continues. All right, or consumes, not continues. <laughs> Still waking up, sort of. Next week should be a little bit better. Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to switch to my uh, other. I have my uh, other mouse. That's my. Oh shoot! It's unplugging currently, but let me fix this. The cable is being pulled on something, it looks like. One sec. <laughs> Ugh, the cable is really... Dang. Got it. <coughs> Got it. Here it is. That's behind my monitor. There. There we go. Struggles of PC game. I guess that any type of gaming can have cables. At least so. I have a ton of pending notifications. All right, here we go. Looks like I was doing the week last time I was logged on here. So, let me just move this mouse there. So I'm using the OG Razer Naga uh, SWOTOR edition. Pretty much got all 12 buttons on the side. Pretty heavy, 
Um, I actually used this as my main mouse for like the longest time. And then my buddy showed me a, game, a, a mouse called the Glorious Gaming Model O. And after seeing that, I, yeah, that completely changed my opinion on the type of mice I was using. So I picked one up, really enjoyed it. And I've been using that as my main mouse, but whenever I go back and play some sort of RPG or anything with these toggles, I pretty much have the memory or memorization of all the buttons on the side. So I switch over to this mouse instead. Um, I'm not going to change any of these for right now because I'm pretty sure it's set up how I want it to be. The only thing I'll have to do is maybe swap some of this out, but we'll see on that. I uh, let's see. I think it was the was it the Gree event that was going on last time I was here. Jay is J L. Where's okay L is. Damn. So we have a lot here. Uh, let me go ahead and drop that. Now hold on to it for now. The max level is 75 now, correct? Yeah, it looks like it is. And we have the entire amount of XP rested for this character. So we should level up pretty fast, which is cool. Um, Weekly, let me drop these because I know I'm not going to do these weeklies for a little bit. Plus, I'm at zero progress. Uh, okay, that's fine for now. How much XP do we need to level up? 1,541,600. I don't feel like that's too bad. Please use all products only as intended. Damn. Forgot how much money I have. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a long time. I don't create oh commander crates, they got rid of these, didn't they? Yeah. And then okay, so the commander crates just convert into new gear. Um, I wish they had like a whoa, they changed this up too. Damn. Uh, is there like a hey, here's all the new stuff that they changed, or it kind of just throws you in? Uh, let's get off of here first, actually. Where? Where's the ship at? Isn't there like a... Oh, is it right here? Yep. Uh, wait. Let me not. How do I get to my ship? Oh my gosh. Why does that minimize every time I click out the game? I mean, I could just use my personal, whatever it's called. Isn't there a way to, there's gotta be a way to travel directly to your ship from here. I'm, I'm here for when the Gree event was going on, but obviously that's not going on right now. Otherwise these, all these guys would be giving out quests. Open galaxy map. Hearts and minds. Wait, can we actually just straight up travel there? Is this the newest quest? Galaxy has changed so much. Time to check in with the Alliance leadership and make sure everyone is on the same page. Okay. Yeah, it looks like we might actually be able to just straight up do that then. Okay. 
try that out. Well, I'm glad that we could just fast travel straight out of there <laughs> instead of having to walk around looking for the ship the entire time. Hopefully they there's some sort of like information like hey, this is what you missed. Here's some uh some stuff you might want to know about. Yada yada yada. Blah blah blah. Also, I forget if I like which side I chose the side with. So I guess we'll find out about that too. Uh, I'm gonna uncheck all these. Okay. Yeah. Check this one too. All right. What is new, my squad? We seem to have everyone. Status reports. Internal Status. security remains solid. I've caught two Republic spies since Osus. Both were disguised as cargo pilots seeking work. Oh, Unfortunately, so I did. they fled before they could be caught and interrogated about their specific objectives. Pretend to be angry. It's good to Ang know we're still angry. so popular. Angry. I suppose that's one way of looking at it. My assets have brought in solid intel from all of the major battles along the front lines. Uh, look who it I'll is. keep forwarding everything to Baywan for analysis. My people are using that intel to create new write-ups for the major field commanders on both sides. Should help us predict strategic probabilities going forward. Until we get a specific request for aid, I've deployed our fleet in a defensive posture around Odessan. There's uh, one other matter we should discuss now that you're aligned with the Empire again. We've accomplished a lot here. I'm proud to have worked under your command. We've made the galaxy a better place. But I'm also proud of my past. I served the Republic for years. I can't fight them. So, I'm retiring. I've recommended a replacement, Commodore Pardax. Ex-Imperial. Very sharp. She'll serve you well. Lana's already vetted her, and I'll stick around long enough to get her up to speed. You've been a huge help to our alliance, Baywan. Thank you for everything you've done. Thank you for taking a chance on me. Nice. Okay, so we did Nothing side so with the Imperials. I thought I, I completely switched it up and sided with the Republic. Alright. Hilo? We've had to step up security for my crews. Piracy is becoming a bigger problem on their runs. Oh no. Lucky for us, you're friends with Mandalore. Now that word spread that her people are riding along, nobody messes with our transports. Good to hear. Anything else? Sana Ray is touring the reconstruction efforts on Vos, so I believe we're finished. Offer some I'd closing like to remarks. Say a few words before we end the meeting. Yes, Commander. Make a great team. I want to thank I'm you in all charge for standing no by me. We've survived so much, overcome so much. I love how that's an option. That was only possible because of all of you. The galaxy is as chaotic as ever. But if we stand by one another. We'll find Fine. our way through. You can count on us. There was one final matter for you. Lord Izar, a representative of the Imperial Outreach Division, has asked to speak with you. I've loaded his frequency into your holocom. All right. Thought we could use a moment alone. I have to admit, it's weird fighting. It's Troy Baker. Republic. Oh boy. Probably should have seen a day like this coming. Somehow, I just never did. I get it. They've never once had your back over the years. Suresh Why is he staring the at the thing. ground? Even so, I need the to heck? know you're in this to win a war, <laughs> not to crush my own What's home What's he doing? Dust. I can do better than that. What do you mean? I'm going to help the Republic win from the inside. Oh, wait, we did. I'm a double agent. You're sure that's a road you want to walk down? I mean, you saw how it went for me. Don't get me wrong, I'm behind you all the way. I just hope you're ready. Does Lana know? She does. 
No one else, though. My lips are sealed. Then I better get out of here and act casual. I'll see you later. Hmm. Oh boy. So I did switch to the Republic. But it's, uh, that's why I kept saying All Saboteur. I see, I see. Okay, well, now we know. Uh, let's not let anybody know. Greetings, Commander. So good of you to contact me. How can I help you, exactly? I serve within the Imperial Outreach Division. Specifically, I seek out opportunities to inspire greatness among our noble frontline soldiers. Darth Krovos is giving a speech to our forces gathered at Viking Space Dock in preparation for their deployment. This could be an opportunity to say a few words of your own. Your actions have made you a living legend, after all. Certainty of victory inspires confidence. Hearing that you are out there fighting the same fight they are will undoubtedly instill that confidence in our troops. I'd be glad to speak to the Empire's soldiers. Splendid. We shall await your arrival with bated breath. Safe travels. So we're going to speak to Empire soldiers. Jonas, are you aware of this rally for Imperial troops on Viking Space Dock? I've heard about it. Sounds like a great opportunity for you to shake their confidence a bit. No need to risk your cover or anything. Just get them to second guess whether they can win, and stress will do the rest. Let me know if they have decent drinks. I might just sneak in myself. Hmm. Meet them on the fleet? Okay. Um, can we actually take... Okay, so we can take Theron with us, but he is level 28. That's the only problem. Um, I mean, I really don't think it's going to make much of a dis difference, but I guess I'll wait until I hit 75 and then I'll swap to Theron. I think we actually... Wait, was that the correct way? Base entrance? Okay. Meet him on the fleet. Alright, so I guess we're heading to the fleet shortly. Is this... I, I guess this icon's new. It shows up over their head now. Am I in a guild right now, too? No, I'm not. Okay. Um, man, it's been so long. Just trying to figure out where I need to go. What do I need to do? <laughs> How do I even get to my ship, man? Oh my gosh. Is this it? Yeah, that's it. Lions camps. I thought the ships were like over here. Elevator, market. Where's my rocket booster? Should be somewhere around here. Oh, there it is. Okay. I got that. Gear. So if we look at this, it's the first outfit I have. Okay. So that's my OG one. And this, and I have that, three, four, I remember that guy, five, okay, sweet, yeah, I forgot about it, a lot of these, companion, ship, All right, let's do the combat proficiencies real quick. Since I'll probably want these. Um, okay. So. I might honestly just pull up a guide. For the previous one that I had. What am I, uh, Verbulence? 
virulence. Virulence sniper. I supposed to take in the in this section come on it is combat proficient Ballistic dampeners. Okay, frequently, anyways, huge advantage. Okay. Ballistic dampeners. Snapshot. Entering cover makes the next snipe lethal shot instantly. Note that it is not a DPS increase and only charges the ability. Okay. Snapshot. And vital regulators. Masterful uh, seat cover. I can't get any of these. I need to put another one in one of these. Activate instantly, increasing your chance for resist force and tech attacks. Countermeasures purge all. Okay. Slow the target for three seconds. Uh, increase the amount of damage absorbed by the shield probe. Pull down. We'll take that. And we need to put one more before we can get to the next one, I guess. Deployed shields. So deployed shields, uh, defensive safeguard, safeguards, and tactical retreat are the ones we're looking at next. And siege bunker. Countermeasures grants. Oh, okay, that's that's when you use countermeasures, though. Uh, series, shot a series slows your target for three twenty seconds, or twenty percent for three seconds. Suppressive fire. Do I use that a lot? I'm not sure if I do. Um, not seeing it. Not in this, at least. Here's the damage. Uh, movement speed. Depressive fire. Where is that? I thought I had that on here somewhere. Take down, call, weakening blast, corrosive strike, target acquired, suppressive fire, there it is. Damage dealt by 25%. Sure. You know, let's take that instead. Okay, now we can take, uh, pillar box.
reduce the cooldown of entrench by 15 and cover pulse by ooh i like that uh siege bunker wait i think that's a different decrease cd on cc immunity yes please that's a different explanation or description siege bunker what's that one reduce all area effects by 50 per 60 percent i think you're seeing what i stood okay all right that'll be it for now and then we should technically get like two more and then i can get the defend uh deployed shields and the other one defense safeguards so these two and then tactical retreat man nobody has a 6.0 guide like this has been out for how long like two months and nobody has one that's surprising to me random mounts what's new to the cartel market let's let's check it out okay uh, let me actually hop off my mount. Say Control M. You're better now. That's kind of cool. One thousand for that. Oof. Master Datacron and equipment bundle, dude. I don't even have enough for that. Dark Lord. Ultimate Cartel, Malchus Reborn. That that face mask is pretty dope. All right. Well, either way, I'm holding on to my uh, my gear for now. I meant to look into guilds beforehand but uh kind of messed that up <laughs> totally forgot to look on online so now i'm just gonna see if i can find any guilds they call I have a bunch of materials and scrap and stuff. Oh, nice. So these actually change to superior renown boosts. That's sick. Uh. So if I go to this. That's that tactical. I don't have a tactical piece on. My item rating is 246. 250. What is max item rating? I think it's like three something. I'm pretty sure. I should go to, um, yeah, I shouldn't be here to, to ask for, go to the fleet. It'll be a lot easier asking questions on the fleet. <laughs> Not on no, whatever that, Oceus, that planet was. Yeah, let's ask that again. <clears throat> I 
306. All right. So I got it. Got it. Guilds recruiting returning players. Let's see. Probably get an invite like any second. Their guild. Somebody's talking about cereal. So they added uh, some cartel people here apparently. Or uh, I think it was traders, something like that. Aha, here we go. Wolves of the Shadow. That seems like a cool name. Do a random pet. I want to put the new pet down. Also, I'll take that invite. How many people do they got in their guild? Okay, nice, nice. Nice, nice. Okay. I see, I see. I never realized I actually had a good amount of pets here. Huh. Uh, let's put the... Where's the new guy at? Oh wait, do I have to... I think I have to... Yeah, yeah. Do that first. Okay. Got him. There he is. Got Troy. Point oh, less. Any good six point oh class guides out there? Does it even matter anymore? I have a very, very similar outfit to that, actually. I remember building all these too. Uh, okay. Talk to Lord. Actually, let me switch outfits again. To activate. Perfect timing, Commander. Darth Krovos is just finishing up. Follow me. I can sense the strength in each and every one of you, the passion for victory, and the power to achieve it. At the muzzles of your blasters, at the points of your blades, our ancient enemies shall finally be destroyed for the Empire! For the Empire. We meet again. Zasha and her family send their regards. With your alliance fighting alongside the Empire, victory is within our grasp. You were promoted, Congratulations well done. Congratulations on joining the Dark Council. Thank you. I hope to serve our Empire as ably as you have. They're all yours. As an assassin tanking guy for 6.0? Okay. Praise Imperial, uh, encourage reform and equality. We are setting out to fight the same war we fought many times before, but the outcome will be different. 
because we are different. Like the most powerful predators, the Empire has grown, <laughs> evolved, learned. We are not the same Empire our enemies faced in the past. No longer do we ignore the strength of those who aren't human or Sith. No longer do we ignore the wisdom of those without the Force. The Empire held itself back before, but no longer. No longer. Now the Republic will face the true strength of the Empire. Now they will face you. To your ships! It's probably going to be like, what was that? An interesting speech, Commander. I'm not sure. I am quite sure. It was a powerful speech, one all the Empire should have heard. I appreciate your time, Commander. I look forward to working with you again someday soon. That was pretty much the opposite of what we were looking for, Commander. Maybe next time we just skip the speech entirely. All right. Is there any way I can go back to uh, <laughs> not doing that? Okay, so that wasn't even uh, onslaught. That was hearts and minds. Okay, well, let's launch it. Hello there. Hello there. Are you sure you're ready to begin preparing the way? You will be transported to mission's location as soon as you accept. Yes. Alright, so this is officially the Onslaught DLC. Oh man. Ahaha, classic. Ahaha. Oh my god, why is it so low? Alright, so let's see. It's been a while. Hopefully this will catch me up on a little bit that I missed. War consumes the galaxy. Hungering for dominance, the ruthless Sith Empire fights to destroy their ancient enemies in the Galactic Republic. Assembling an overwhelming fleet of the Empire's most powerful warships, Darth Malgus. Oh, he's back. It's out to obliterate a new and highly advanced Republic shipyard on the planet Corellia. Now, desperate to prevent this catastrophe, catastrophe, the Republic rushes to gather the forces necessary to defend this vital facility, one that could finally turn the tide of the war in their favor. Alright, so that's pretty much it. So we're on to Corellia, and we're going to try to help the Republic in a way, even though we're Imperial. Kind of, I'm starting to wish that I kind of did stay Imperial, um, but I made that decision a while ago. We're kind of stuck with it, so worst case, I can always do it on another character plenty of options there. Escort one to Overlord, scanning for hostiles now. Not today, scum. Escort one to Overlord. Spring the trap. We have you now. Jumped. Blast. So 
it closed. No matter. Their story will warn others against challenging us. Let's regroup. Commander. Malgus. Your assistance for up, the 38th buddy? Fleet's operations has been exemplary. But I am now recalling them for a special assignment. Empress Asina invites you to join a special meeting of the Dark Council aboard Viken Space Dock. We will discuss the details of the operation there. Few outside of the Sith have ever been invited to such a meeting. Such is our respect for your strength. I'm glad I could help prove the value that non-Sith bring to the Empire. You and those like you may yet teach the Empire the full strength that it possesses. We await your arrival. Malgus out. Alright. I'm going to meet up with these guys. The Meridian Complex. A state-of-the-art Republic shipyard. It nears completion on the planet Corellia. My spies report that it can produce ships faster than any of our shipyards and at half the energy cost. That hardly seems possible. Based on the technical readouts Zarian has acquired, I assure you it is entirely possible. Ooh. Perhaps it is even a conservative estimate. Malgus. Krovos. Your plan for destroying this facility? By securing our frontline positions and withdrawing all but the most crucial warships, we have formed an assault armada of unrivaled size and power. Under our command, this mighty fleet will burn the Republic's new shipyard to ash and destroy any hope of victory that might remain among their people. And the Is rest the of Corellia? Is your only target? Do you have plans for the rest of the planet? We may pursue additional targets of opportunity, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. We have gathered enough fuel ships to carry our fleet to Corellia without stopping. Our enemies are in no such position. The Republic will scramble reinforcements from all corners of the galaxy. Wherever they stop to resupply, we must disable or destroy them. We have already identified one likely refueling point for the Republic ships. The planet Onderon. Conveniently, I am already mm. engaged in operations to undermine Republic control of that planet. However, my forces are meager, to say the least. But with the aid of the Alliance and its commander, I am confident that I can successfully delay any Republic reinforcements that pass by. Sounds good to me. I look forward to working with you, Lord Savig. I'll have my forces join yours right away. I look forward to what we can accomplish together. Excellent. Keep your spies in place, Sharian. We must know everything about the shipyard and its defenses. Anathel, Varon, be ready to provide any assistance that Malgos or Krovos should request. This operation is the Empire's top priority. Top Understood. priority. My logistical networks are entirely at their disposal, Empress. Then this meeting is complete. Chris will be respectful and professional. Always. Always. Who's that? Commander! Fancy meeting you here. I'm Major Anry. Are you joining the mission on Onderon? Nah, I pulled Darth Baron's operation this time. We're headed for some mined out rock called Mekshar. But word is we might catch up groundside on Corellia. Everyone with a strong arm or sharp aim is heading for Corellia should be quite a battle. If you're there, the rest of us probably won't even get the chance to lift the finger. Major Anry, I need he's, to speak with the commander. He's a tall boy. Alone. Of course, my lord. Oh, man. Please excuse me. Until next time, commander. It is the nature of Sith to seek their own advancement. Members of the Dark Council, most of all. Victory on Corellia benefits us all. It advances us all. Should Lord Savick or any other council member forget their priorities in my absence, the Empress grants you leave to remind them. They will not forget their duty to the Empire on my watch. Good. Lord Savick awaits you. Farewell, Commander. 
So it seems like in, Lana. it doesn't change much. Onderon. Take everyone we can Whichever spare. side you choose. You'll be briefed on arrival. Understood. We'll depart for Onderon at once. It's just I'm sure the, the endings are a little bit different. So there's probably like four we different endings each. Anything like this. Let's start the next one. I need to check the, the legacy information too. Whenever I get the, um, when I'm not in a menu. Welcome to Onderon. This is the royal hunting lodge of King Petrith, the current ruler of the planet. Onderon has been a republic planet for centuries. These cutscenes don't like cares. his jacket. He just wants to sell his planet's resources <laughs> to anyone willing to pay. Which is where the empire comes in. Exactly. Petrov's greed makes him an easy target for Savic to manipulate, but his nobles aren't playing. Petrov may have oh, snap. Friends, but the nobles have control of the capital city and Alexander, train mayor. Thank you for the raid. How you doing? And welcome. What is the Republic fleet we meant to destroy? Uh. Still gathering in orbit. They're preparing for refueling and resupply operations. Oh man, that's Savic a little doesn't bit. have the resources during to a cutscene too. On, so. <laughs> How you doing? Sure thank you, thank you. Doing it for her. Going on, Gab. Gab boy. All right, let's get All right, started. Let's find Savik and get started. Good. How about you? Of I'm course. doing pretty good. You'll find them just Chill inside. Them. Just getting back in the Star Wars Old Republic. What were we playing? And how how did that stream go? Thank you very much for the raid. Really do appreciate it. <laughs> 